hello guys welcome to cat cam tutor channel uh, in this video i'm going to show you how to use screwmate uh, properly uh, last video also i have done some uh, sample methods on sample mates on uh, solidworks screwmate but uh, in here i want to go to uh, in detail view about the screwmate so here uh, i have made a nut and bolt to uh, show you what uh, is going on in here uh, you know that uh, first we want to have a screw made we have to uh, make a coincident uh, bolt and nut in a one one uh, one axis so do that uh, go to view and show and hide uh, properties make axis and temporary axis enable to show you uh, so in screw made uh, total i am going to discuss uh, what is in here the revolutions per millimeters and uh, what is the uh, distance per revolutions the different of what is the different of uh, these two is uh, what i am going to discuss today and i will show you how to add a mate uh, screw mate in here and i will show you how we uh, choose these parameters in this video so i will uh, i am I think uh, you will enjoy my video series uh, yet so subscribe my channel and share with your engineering friends to uh, want more solidworks tutorials like this and other mates will be uh, published so soon by uh, what I have made for you so let's go to the today video and then first thing is uh, we, we have to clarify uh, what is this uh, this scenario so ratio uh, revolutions per millimeter and the distance per revolutions what is the different then so revolutions uh, when going one revolutions we what distance which gone the total it is the uh, concept of pitch and when we discuss about this uh, bolt and nut uh, where we can find the pitch is in here so i'm going to uh, select one of these uh, because the because the pitch is both mm, having a same pitch so it is not a different thing uh, for one to one and so that uh, I'm going to use uh, these thread features to find out the pitch so when you are designing the uh, screw screw mate in uh, whole wizard item uh, features we have he in here the M5, M5 means the radius of the uh, cross section in here and the point 8 into the point 8 means the uh, pitch so totally you can uh, clearly see in these two bars where the point 8 is uh, considered as the pitch so it is about pitch and we are and now I am applying the uh, thread and go and see and uh, again rebuild and go to the screw mate and here uh, the distance per revolutions means 0.8 so it is totally the pitch and what is the revolutions per millimeter so one when we are traveling one millimeter what what are the revs, uh, rev revolutions going on in the direction so i am here using uh, calculator to uh, show you what happened in here uh, so totally i am uh, dividing one into one by uh, my pitch so it gives me the revolutions per millimeter so it's 1.25 so i'm applying 1.25 in here so this is this uh, this options two options are different things in this comment so when i apply 1.25 millimeters uh, it will be uh, going on uh, correct way so i will show you both of ways uh, after taking a mate so i'm deleting this mate and i will show you how we are doing this <coughs> so i will uh, get out this nut uh, nut by the bolt so uh, pressing keyboard d i can apply uh, this crook section and uh, can have this crook section in here i will show you sorry uh, okay now i applied uh, using space bar I'm using so first thing is we have to mesh both these and uh, we have to coincide with these uh, thread cuts 
so I'm using here and make sure to apply uh, they are, keep some distance between here to select the valley part in here and uh, we have this part okay it's okay so I'm uh, using change transparency properties to change transparency on the nut so I can clearly identify where the mating screws are going on and the mesh so I think it is in here so mount and uh, adjust some little bit okay okay now it is okay now I'm uh, again change transparency and remove the cross sections because I want to mate and so under the mates use mechanical mates to uh, make the screw mates so I have to select the top part and the belly part so I can select simply in here so then I want to select the valley parts in here so I think it is in here okay now I select the, the uh, face we have to select faces one is on the board and one is on not so it is now okay and here is the directions when we have so when I want to use one of these options to make the screw so when distance and resolution it means the pitch my pitch is 0.8 or you can have revolutions per millimeter that means 1.25 it is okay and so simply we can use distance per revolution so directly the pitch if we don't uh, if we know the pitch it is okay but we yeah, and divide by 1 by uh, 1 point uh, 1 by 0.8 we can have this revolutions per millimeter so it is totally the same thing but it is we have to calculate to get the revolutions per millimeter so I'm keeping one of these options and now I'm applying the mate so you can see that it is now going on to the knot um, now on to the bolt with this screw I will change transparency to see what happened inside the means you can see that it is perfectly meshed with the uh, uh, bolt mesh it is okay uh, I mean change the transparency and I have a I will go to get a cross section in here selecting by D okay now I select this section view and now apply see now it is perfectly missed and going point eight pitch by the revolution okay you can round in here uh, all the positions it is meshing with the screw very perfectly here see Okay, this is what I want to show you, uh, share with you how to make a screw made uh, perfectly and what is the difference between uh, these two now I am okay with that so try these uh, simple videos with me uh, soon I will publish other tutorials about mating too if you want to see how we uh, build this nut and uh, bolt and how we apply the screw and how we add the threads uh, and the this dome how we use the screw cut to get this perfect uh, edge so there things will be discussed by the different video I will uh, I have links put in the descriptions so uh, join with my channel to see these kind of videos with me so share with this content with your friends engineering friends too and thank you for watching my video. Goodbye.